Hello everyone and welcome to Free CAD Tutorials. In this tutorial we explain how to copy 3D objects. Besides that we also explain how to move 3D objects and how to rotate them. So let's immediately start. Over here you can see a simple 3D object I created. Now I would like to copy this object and I would like to place the copy on top of this 3D objects and then I would like to rotate for a certain angle this copied object. So let's learn how to do that. First of all, find the model menu over here and click on body. There are several ways to copy 3D objects. One of the approaches is to simply press Ctrl C and then you can press OK. And this will copy the object. Another approach is to, do, is to do the right click and then simply copy. Okay, so let's do the first approach once again, Control C, OK, and then let's paste the object. So where to do that? Well, over here simply press Control V, or you can simply click on the object and click on paste. And here is the copy. Now, the original object and its copy are currently overlapping, as you can see over here. Now, let's move this new object such that you can see it. Expand this base menu over here and expand placement. Over here, click on the top and click on these three dots and let's see what will happen over here. Note that the coordinate system is given over here. Z is in this direction, X is in this direction and Y is in this direction. Since Z is in this direction which means this means that if we change the z value you will see how the object is being moved here let's for example enter something like 100 or let's do let's 150 to see what will happen or something like this okay so here it is let's again adjust a little bit this position let's go with for example something like this good good okay now this object is being copied, or better to say, the copied object is being moved so we can see it over here. I will click OK and then I will change the color of this object. You can simply click on the object and click on Appearance and over here you can click and then change the color. Let's go with something like this and let's go OK and here it is. Close this. Next, let's learn how to rotate this object. To do that, click on this object, then again click on placement, expand it, and notice over this, over here this menu. Expand this. Here you have several ways to rotate objects. You can rotate axis and angle or you can use Euler angles. Let's go with the first option since it's simple, simple to understand. Okay. Over here, you need to select the axis. This is actually the unit vector of the axis. Currently, Z axis is being selected. And then if you change the angle of rotation, you can see how the object is rotating over here. Let's now zoom in. Here it is. Okay, let's go to zero. And then let's change the axis. To change the axis, select this unit vector to be zero and let's rotate around the X axis. Consequently here should be one. And now if you're starting to rotate, you can see how the object, actually this is the rotation around the Y axis, my apology. So, and now you can see how the rotation is being done around the Y axis. So let's change and let's set the X axis for rotation. And over here you can see how the object is being rotated around the x-axis. After you rotate the object, simply click on apply and click on OK and everything will be saved. And that's basically it. Thanks for watching. 